We are focusing on our open offer. We believe that uh, everything is above board and uh, sooner than later all the regulators will give us the uh, nod to, to proceed and close, mm -hmm. close the acquisition. But do you believe that this is now delayed and it perhaps will continue to get delayed because this is now not just about the open offer but there are other allegations about propriety etc involved? No, I don't believe so. We are waiting for a CCI approval which we believe will come in a few weeks after mm -hmm. that. Uh, the RBI and RD, RDA and finally the SEBI. Mm. Uh, with some of these regulators we already work with, as uh, I'm, I'm already um, um, into insurance companies, mm. uh, Aviva and Universal Sompo, so mm. I don't think uh, we should have any problem uh, getting our um, getting our regul getting the regulators. Uh, so first off the block will be CCI yes. and they will then the other regulators yes. will uh, come into play. Do you believe that these um, these allegations and everything else which is happening will impact approval from the regulators because after all this is a uh, financial services yeah. company no, see, I, I, I don't foresee any I don't foresee any problem because we're here we're doing everything about board I'm here to I'm here to answer to any regulators I'm here you know to provide them with any information they need and baseless allegations will continue much singing will continue but we're going ahead and doing our job mm. uh, just to uh, just to go back what caused the disruption the rupture in that sense in your opinion as you said I mean you've been uh, long time shareholders and they were okay yeah. Uh, but now something went wrong. So that's well, everything. I mean, everything was fine until you know the, the 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 chairperson needed to be voted back in. So of course, at that time she accepted uh, all the she accepted our offer and and uh, and said that you know she will help us in 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 getting all the permissions as well as uh, helping us uh, mm -hmm. you know navigate uh, getting into the business and un making us understand the business as mm -hmm. soon as we as soon as we voted her back in uh, now she's using all that against us mm -hmm. Uh, so, uh, but, but to be clear, you, yeah. uh, did you want her to continue or did you want, to, when the open offer uh, bit happened, mm. did you uh, want her to continue as the, uh, the helm of affairs or uh, no, what was the offer given a, to her? What uh, was the discussion? No, as far as, far as we are concerned, listen, we don't want to upset uh, the, the management as well as uh, the board. Uh, we, we, uh, we are professional, all our businesses are run professionally, family members only take seats on the board. And even in this case, all our discussions were centered around the fact that at the most, you know, we may supplement the board with some, uh, some more uh, people, uh, you know, who can add value to the business and as well as provide capital to each of the businesses to take it to the next level. Mm -hmm. There was no question or about us replacing anyone. Uh, no, but you, you said right now that, uh, you know, when she uh, sort of understood that she perhaps will be voted out, mm -hmm. and that's when the, uh, that's when, uh, you know, she well, kind of... Well, you know, I mean, if she, if she assumes that, uh, if she assumed that, um, I don't know why, because as far as we were concerned, we wanted a smooth transition, and that's why we voted her back in. Mm -hmm. But what was the offer specifically? That I mean, the executive chairperson uh, position would be held by. No, uh, we were. There were no. There were no. There were no, there were no negotiations to the um, mm. um, to how how the business and what positions anyone would hold after the open. Mm. But roughly, was there an indication? Because she would have gotten this, uh, gotten an indication from the conversation that you had. So they're just trying to understand. Did you offer her to continue on the board? While yes, absolutely. Sort of I mean, there was no there was no discussion on any replacement. Uh, and as far as we were concerned, you know, we were happy to have a continue on the board. Mm -hmm. Now as a chairperson or as just as a board member was something which wasn't discussed. Mm -hmm. Although to be fair, there are only yeah. I think two institutional investors yeah. and then there is, uh, I mean, you as a large yeah. investor, right? Yeah. So, uh, so, so no institutional investors? Uh, I, I, I'm not sure what, the state, what their status yeah. is in terms of whether yeah. they've been asked, they've been denied or whatever. They were well, promised can, but never voted yeah, on. Yeah, absolutely. Um, Similar. You can, but you can. But have you spoken to the other sh other two? No, no. We believe we, not only the other two. We believe all the shareholders are supporting us. Mm. But have you spoken to the large, the two large no, yes, uh, institutional shareholders? Yeah, regular. There's always a regular dialogue. After this entire uh, no, thing, there is a regular dialogue. And what's what? What are they telling no, you? I, we believe that we have their full support. Mr. Baban, uh, let's just talk about that open offer price. How significant do you think that is in this entire scheme of things? Or you think it's gone beyond that? It's not about the price anymore. I mean, if tomorrow you were to raise the price, do you think things can be brought back on track? We are well above the you know SEBI price formula, mm. so I don't think it's well with the price. If if they if there's if they if there's someone else who's willing to give a higher price, then let them also make a, you know let them come in the fray. I don't mind. Mm. It's not a it's not a it's not a something which we we believe we've offered a, a, a fair price for the business mm. and and let the shareholders decide. Are you willing to go up? Well, at this point of time, no, I'm not. Mm.
if this were to stretch on beyond a point, and you just said that, well, you will kind of furnish information and you expect this to be resolved, but if this is not, and it kind of uh, goes on, lingers on, <coughs> would, you, would, you, uh, would you be willing to get out of the company? I mean, sell your shares and get out? Or is that... As I said, you know, as I said, if, if, if the company says that we're not fit and proper and they find someone else who offers more money, yeah, maybe, why not? Given everything else which is happening, you think it's likely that we will see the uh, care IPO sort of coming through the stables really again? Well, I, I, unless unless all this uh, unless you open up for first phase and sort it out, I doubt it will come. Mm. Uh, Mr. Burman, just to press on that point, uh, that option that you are talking about, which is calling for uh, EGM and asking shareholders to vote on whether they like the current management at top and whether they, you'd, they'd like a new uh, sort of. Uh, leader at the top, and why is that not not an active so sort of a, topic? Under that's an option you were talking about. But uh, as far as we we're concerned, we are evaluating various options at this point of time. As I said, we're concentrating on our open offer. We're concentrating on answering all the questions that the different regulators have. Mm. We believe we've made a fair and uh, you know, above board offer for the company, and therefore we will keep on focusing on that. Mm. Other options are there, but as of as of now, we are not... Uh, I'm just pressing on that option because yeah. obviously this has gone beyond just the open offer price with yeah. the allegations which have been traded. Yeah. I mean, it's kind of very inconceivable that you will now be willing to work if the open offer goes through and you get to uh, where you want to get to in terms of shareholding. Yeah. You'll be able to work with the current uh, yeah. sort of person at top. And that's the reason why I'm... I mean, eventually it will perhaps come down to that. At some point, well, as I said, you know, we have various options, and you know, we are being advised by able uh, the legal team as well as our merchant bankers. And uh, as I said, those we will only look at those options once uh, you know these. Uh, 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 you know, we have a situation where we need to exercise those.